<laughs> scary, I know. Okay, so as you can see, my hair is like freaking shrink. This is what you call African American hair. I have no kind of perm. I don't wear perms. I'm just, I'm not just gonna do those. Um, so like I said, no perm. Just true African American hair. Uh, so what I did is just wet it. Just get a little damp. I wet it with hot water so it can open up all your hair pores. Just open them all up. So. Okay, I just got done washing my hair. I used Swap. Um, I don't know what kind of use, just a pink bottle. Got this at Walmart for like a dollar something each for these. Um, I love them. I love Swap. I love Swap everything. Um, so I didn't feel that I had to show you guys how to wash your hair. I felt like everybody should know how to wash your hair, but just a couple of little tips. On washing your hair, shampoo, always start off with hot water when you start on shampoo. That way it opens up all of your um, your pores and all that. So, and then massage, take your time, massage your hair slowly, massage and you know, scalp and everything with shampoo with hot water. Once you get it, you know, rinse it twice or whatever, you do your conditioner, rinse it out with um, cold water, that way it's lock in all of the Condition is just put Okay, so yes, I took the towel off. This is what it looks like after I get done washing it. Yes, this is true African American hair. Um, no, I don't have any primer as you can tell. Otherwise, it would have been all soft and silky and all that. So it's just called true African American hair. <laughs> In the hair. Um, next thing I'm going to apply my hair mayonnaise. This is organic, um, I think it's carrot, is it carrot? Something carrot on here. Um, but this is treatment for weak and damaged hair. I love this. Got this at Walmart for like five dollars, I think. This is what it looks like. This is what the, the jar looks like. Oh my gosh, that's not so good. We just don't know, it's just, oh my god. So what I'm going to do is, first I'll just take my hand and apply it. At the roots of my, I mean the edges of my hair first. Ah, it's still something like that. And just smack it all on my hands. It's basically because this stuff is hard. On my hand. Oh, this is what I would look like if I was bald headed. <laughs> I hate this face with a bald head. Mm -hmm. And I just cut my hair off, right? No, I'm just kidding. Okay, so. Don't need to clip this. Um, I got all over my hair like I said like in time. Now let's take it to the shower bag. And we're gonna put the shower bag on and let this sit in our head for 10 minutes. We're gonna put the shower bag on so that we apply the um, heat to it to make the cream look like the Walmart or Sally's, I don't remember, it's red wine. A little bit of the other that's left on it. This is my favorite blow dry ever, 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 ever. This blow dry don't play, it will burn the sh out of you. And this hair comb does not come with this. I got this hair comb sample from um, Sally's, I think. Sally's at Walmart, I don't know. I'm going to take this carrot oil. Carrot and ole oil. Who would you buy? Mega Care? I don't know. This is very old, so I will say it'd be very tough on this. I like to put it at the very tip right here. Because it's always dry on my edges. And then I take one, two, three, four drops like this. And I see rub this in. And smear it all in my hair. I got to I'm just I'm um, taking this um, care cream. Can't 
shield tucked away down. Um, hair care cream like this. Very orange looking. I know the camera's showing it. She doesn't look what it's orange. Um, what's that? I don't like the yellow. Taking very little like this. Much. Rubbing it. Especially on my ends. My ends are really, really dry. Um, so next, um, taking my flatter. Stuck inside the drawer. And I don't use this style from the front or the side, but I'm just doing this so I can show you guys how I flatter my hair. Um, let's see if you guys can see it. Make sure I get the, the roots. So that way you know what I'm going to And I slowly take the time. Bring it down. Do it again. Slowly. Bring it down. And voila. And we start this however. Yeah. We stop right here if you want, but me, I like to have a little um curl you know the under bounce to it so i'm using my paper spritz for the gold spray the pink one taking my flat iron and i'm crowning it i'm going to curl it extremely tight i'm going to use my extremely tight curl it this high up I'm just brushing it into a nice little circle. I'm taking it like this. I'm going to turn it and then you want to take your scarf and brush it the way that you combed your hair to. So I comb my hair this way. So I'll take the scarf, twist it, twist it, twist it, and then tie it. Where's my end of that? Just make sure I get, got all the hair in place. Put my scarf on. My sleeve wash. As you can see, I have the full doodle wrap, I call it. The doodle wrap. So what I'm going to do is wake it up. See how it just falls down. And see this is why I curl it before wrapping up. As you can see it has that, that little curl, curve thing going on. So yeah. Okay, everybody. This is my final look. See the fastness. See how healthy it looks. Yeah. So yeah, so this is exactly what I did for the lemon line look tutorial. Again, it would be right here. Yeah. And the baby who wants to look. That's why I got a lot of questions. So this is exactly what I did for those two. Um, I usually only have to do is to put my hair every two weeks. At the most. Yeah, every two weeks. So I'm going to give you guys my three month update because this is my flat hair during my period. So this is all natural, flat iron, just hair spray, no perm. So if you have a perm, this probably rock even more better, but yeah. This is it. This is it. <laughs>